Hey gamers, it's Grind This Game here. Uh, starting a new base. We got a new upgrade, quality of life uh, upgrade Mark III just came out today. And I'm excited to start a new base. Um, there's a bunch of new changes, new changes to disease, and but I'll talk about it as we go here. So I'm going to do a new game. I do have one, there's mods available now, and I've, I'm using this one mod called Speed Control which basically allows you to do uh, 10x speed as the fastest speed instead of 5, I think. And this is by Javisar. Hopefully I'm pronouncing your name right. Uh, and I'm going to do a standard game. Last time I did a custom map, I'm just going to do a standard map this time around. Everything default. I'm going to do... I'm going to click custom though, just so I can use a random seed here, just so you know that I'm using a seed. I'm going to uh, I'll just use a random one. So this is the seed I'm going to use. Sandbox no mode no, world default, yeah. Everything's default except for the seed. I wanted to make sure it was random. So I don't know what I'm getting. I'll put this in the description though. So, jobs are different. We're going to be doing a little bit more specialization. Uh, we'll see how that goes. Probably have like one or two dupes in each role. Maybe one for research, one for art, one for uh, medicine. Let's see who we got here. We're, there will be no farters in the base. I've had, I did a, a farter base once with uh, flatulent dupes and it was a nightmare. Mouth breathers, no. No mouth breathers. Yoko. Uh, allergies is new. Sneeze uncontrollably when exposed to pollen. Oh, narcoleptic diver's lungs. Artist. Okay, that sounds good. Narcoleptic gourmet. I'm not going to be very picky here. Um, I'm going to grab some with allergies just to see what that's all about. And for the name, let's go with... Uh, Lucky Hospital. <laughs> that sounds good with the new medical update. I think all these dupes are going to end up being sick, so... We shall see. And right away, I'm going to set some of these dupes uh, with custom names. Now, I do have a patron tier for uh, having, your, having your name. If you're a patron supporter in a certain tier, you can be in the base. And I, hopefully I'm spelling everyone's name right here. These are some of my longer supporters, longer term supporters, some new in, new ones as well. If you're a Patreon, Patreon supporter and you want to be in the base, let me know. But for now, I've got a few ready to go here. Peaches, Dell, and Jean is close to Jared. Let's do Jared. Jared, welcome. Okay, what are we going to do first? Let's just see what we got. We got uh, a little bit of water here, a little bit of water there. Oh, polluted water. I usually don't get to see this that early on. We'll start slow here. Uh, let's start digging. Let's start digging. I like to tap into the water right away. Now, medium speed... It's kind of like the old fast speed, and fast speed is like turbo fast. I won't be using that that much, but we'll go normal fast speed. And I'm going to be pausing a bit here because I want to make sure I do everything the way I want to do it. Got water up here. So toilets first. Usually I do my toilets on the left. But we got all this water here. I don't want my toilets near that. <laughs> so maybe we'll dig, dig this way too. But not too far, because I don't want to have an accident here. So yeah, I like to do toilets first. So that there's no accidents. But I need to get into the water first. So let's do pitch a pump right here. So we get water first. Then we build the sink. A few sinks. I like to actually build three. I'm not going to be spacing this out very... I'm going to just kind of do things quickly without much planning this time. 
So, room for three sinks. Oh, I'm gonna run out of room here. Let's just do two sinks. And then get the water in there, set the priority in the sinks to seven, which is usually what I like to do. Get the water in there, and then we're gonna do an outhouse. I'm kind of like, not a whole lot of room for, oops, I don't want it there. Let's try that again. Leave room for one more sink. You know what, I'll just make it a smaller bathroom. We'll get two of each. And we want to put a door on it so it's an actual bathroom. Looks good. Now I don't want this water to ever get polluted, so I might put a little tile here just in case they pee on the floor, which I, they hope, hopefully they won't, but. Now I'm gonna set the outhouses to priority eight. And I guess we'll start digging down here. I want to get down here and get all this free food. Let's do that. Let's just do a ladder here. Why not? Get into the algae a little bit here. And I like to get bedrooms during the first cycle too. This probably won't be the permanent place, but I'll just chuck them in here. Actually, I don't want that one there. Oh, they can't get in there. Never mind. Let's, uh, let's put the beds. Oh, it's too late. They're already eating and I'm gonna sleep soon. And I'll use super speed. I'm calling it super speed, but it's just the mod. During the nighttime. Not the whole night, but. Then we can kind of plan out what we're gonna do here. So I wanna get this muck root. Let's dig that up. And I'm going to replace some tiles here. Underneath one toilet, but not both. We'll get a ladder going up this way. Get this muck root. Oh, and let's go all the way up. We'll go, go up here and get all this free food. Delicious food. I like to get all the free food kind of early on here. Because we don't start with that much. And where do I want my bedroom to be? This bathroom's a little bit small. I gotta get I gotta get using this water actually first. Oh, there's a bunch of germs in there though. Slime lung in there. Slime lung's pretty nasty now, I must admit. Let's allow these to be everything. Priority eight. And let's get in here. I'm gonna dig up this oxalate. I think it'll be okay. There's allergens and stuff too now. There's floral scents, there's zombie. I've never even seen a zombie spore or a floral scent. This is all new to me. I'm gonna set these all to auto harvest. Auto harvest, auto harvest. Everything we can see basically. Okay, bedrooms. Where do I want the bedrooms? I'm gonna put them, for now, maybe right above here. Bedrooms there, and then multi-purpose, maybe above the printing pod here. Let's dig this out a bit, get some algae. Go a little bit faster here. I will be using the faster speed just for like when they're just digging and stuff. Or sleeping. Okay, bedrooms. Before it's too late. Uh, one, two. I'm gonna build four beds because we'll eventually have four dupes. And more. Oh, I missed it. Cycle two and they don't even get a bed. Oh well. I'll probably start off with six dupes. So let's just do six six of those for now. 
And maybe leave room for seven. Ah, we'll just do six. Dig that out. That sand is gonna <laughs> that sand is gonna cave in on their heads. Sleeping on the floor. Okay, so that'll be bedrooms, bathrooms. I could move this door over a little bit. These are not permanent. I, I need to leave room for my uh, my fire pole, which will probably be along here. I'm gonna take this tile out because I want good airflow. And same kind of idea. I'm gonna dig out this so that there's a bit more room for air. Same here. Everything's falling to the bottom. And let's put a proper floor on the bedroom floor here. We'll build it in stages. Now, sometimes the toilets get in perfect sync. Uh, and then they both have to be cleaned at once and you can get accidents on the ground. So what I'm going to do is force this one to be cleaned. A little bit early, a little bit premature, but... Okay, let's build some more floors here, keep everyone busy. I'm going to try to avoid all slime lung areas early on because disease is worse. The way it works now, as of as of right now, is that if they encounter germs, they have a chance of getting a disease. And uh, yeah, I think the chance goes up the more they encounter the germs, but I'm not quite sure. Okay, more digging, more digging, keep busy. This will be multi-purpose. Oh, we gotta do or something. Let's see what we got here. Allergy, squeamish, unconstructive. Loud sleepers. I don't like loud sleepers. Can't research. Uh, that should be okay. Or we could get more shine nymphs. I need dupes more than anything. Okay, so research is next. We got power. Couple batteries wire and a research station this is kind of my typical order here got sand built up and I usually do storage under the portal I don't know why but we'll just put a few storage containers there let's dig uh, getting that sand out so it doesn't fall on their heads. Bathroom time. Now I could set these to left. It's probably safe. Make sure the priority's all good. Eight, eight, seven, seven. Yep, good. Having their social hour. Sleepy, sleepy. Turbo sleep. <laughs> okay, once we get the research station in some early research here. I'm gonna get some of this metal because we're gonna we're gonna need it. Mushrooms up here. More food over here. I should probably try to get in here. Use the free food first. Okay, research. What do we want to do here? I'll probably want to do jobs early on, so employment. But maybe I'll do food first. Farming. So I can get some meal lice going. I think I'll do f basic farming first. And set the priority on the research station to eight or seven. Food's okay at the moment, but that won't last for long. Now these containers, I'll do sweep only, all, except, no polluted dirt. Sweep only, sweep only. And then we can sweep up some of these areas here. Make sure I don't have polluted dirt. Yeah, 
Okay. Do a low priority sweep, priority three, just so they're not idle. They can clean up their bedrooms and stuff. So if they're not busy, they can do some sweeping. Yeah, let's clear all these off. Maybe put a few more containers in here because it's going to fill up. I got to pick a place for food. How's our oxygen? Oxygen's still pretty good. What are we doing for algae? We got no, not a whole lot of algae, but I can put in, I can dig some more here. I'll put in some container floors here. There they go. That's a CO2 down there. Holy turbo speed. <laughs> Bathroom break, sleep break. Now a few of you don't like super speed, so I'll only use it for when they're kind of sleeping or doing boring tasks. So after we this after the food, I gotta set up a place for food. So let's do where should we do this? It doesn't really matter where. Maybe I'll do a floor here. It won't be the permanent place. It's never for me it's never permanent. <laughs> we'll be moving things around. Okay, food's done. Now I'm gonna do employment next. I need a place for all that CO2 to go as well. So, start doing a ladder down this way. Make sure there's no germs down here. Oh, there's some down here. This is for the CO2 to fall down. And food. I'm just going to use the basic planters for now. Just to get some mealwood going. Mealwood. Priority seven, copy those settings. Now I'm gonna use a, uh, I think I'm gonna use a food calculator later on. Um, there's a good app out there for like rocket calculations, food calculations, geyser calculations, all that stuff. So I'll probably be using that in future episodes. I've used the rocket calculator in the past. It's pretty slick. I like it. And I'm going to dig on either side here so that the air can travel down. These are going to be roughly one hour episodes. Just like I used to do in the past. Okay, how are we doing for food? 19,000. I kind of want to get this food. Let's do that. Unrefrigerated food. We'll get to it. Let's our schedule look. Good. Stress is fine. Now there's no more germ there's no more immune immune system they just get sick kind of based on a random number generator okay we're running a little bit low on food there's a little bit more in here we can harvest and the mealwood is coming along I'm probably gonna dig up this wild, this wild mealwood so I can re replant it. Let's add some more mealwood there. We don't wanna hit this slime though. Danger, danger. 
Oh, someone's sick. Someone was sick. Allergic reaction. That's new. Okay, is there was there some germs or pollen somewhere? No, not around here. What did they get? By breathing oxygen. Okay. Fine. Maybe polluted oxygen, because we're not cleaning it yet. Okay, we can take on another dupe here, I think. Or food. Oh, free food. I'm going to do free food. Slow learner, diver's lungs. Uh, yeah, let's just do free food. Oh, that damn hatch is going to eat it. Maybe. Oh, no, he got it. Perfect. <laughs> we're still going way too fast here. Okay, that's all dug out. Uh, dig this out. Okay, next research. Uh, well, we do gotta do jobs next. But I think I'll do meal prep so we can get a kitchen going on. Let's copy these settings. Copy these settings. Yeah, we're gonna have to put this polluted dirt somewhere at some point. I'll probably put a compost in there at some point. But I gotta—I want to get tap this water, but there's slime line in here. Jeez, it's kind of in the way. Let's do a jobs board. Uh, stations, jobs board. We got skills. Okay, here we go. Skills is bored. Let's see what we got. Jurd, what are you good at? You're good at art. Uh, Peaches, you're good at farming and tinkering. Dell's good at construction and medicine. Okay, Dell, you're going to be our medic. Peaches, you're going to be our farmer. And Jurd, what did I say here? Medic. Farmer, artist, for now. And I'm going to assign their hats so I remember what they're actually doing. So art, farmer, medicine. And then Devin, Devin is still leveling up. We're gonna need food at some point. I think this meal wood might be enough. Maybe. Dig up a few of these bluff, bluff briars. Okay, once we get the this food research done, then we can build a mess hall. I'm gonna change this bathroom. There's more room here. There's no reason to be there. Lauren. And then take that out. Okay, I'm gonna force clean this. Oh, they're, they're out of sink. That's okay. Now I can fit a sink and another toilet in here, so I'm gonna do it just for redundancy. Meal time. They're so cute. I love this new hat, the new medical hat. Speed through the night. Okay, one more sink, one more toilet. I want my, I want my toilet here though, so we'll copy that and then take that one out. Direction left, priority seven.
Oh, how's oxygen? Oh, it's getting a little bit low in here. I'm going to do a diffuser right here. Some power. The algae terrarium is pretty darn good, but it gives off polluted oxygen now. Which may be a little bit more of an issue. I'm going to take this sink out, put a toilet in there instead. Check our room bonus. Barracks. Good. Three toilets. I'm going to make a separate schedule. And it'll just be offset from this one a little bit. So, gallon time. Be here. Work here. Bedtime here. And bath time there. And we'll kind of offset the schedule here. I think I did that right. Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. We can build a mess hall now. I'm going to put that up here. door on there. Ceiling. And we want mess tables. I'll build five for, or six for now. And next research. Uh, I'll do... What will I do? I'll do... Actually, let's do advanced research so we can open some stuff up. I like to do coal power pretty early on just to get them not running on the wheel so much. And I like to replace this, these tiny batteries with a smart battery because these are terrible. Okay, we got a mess all. Get a bit bigger. Make the uh, oxygen thing priority seven. It's pretty important. Oh, Devin. <laughs> so we need airflow tiles pretty soon to help get the CO2 to the bottom. And we need other stuff. Okay, we need, let's see. Devin, what are you good at? Farming and digging. I guess you can be a digger. We really need a researcher, but ideally someone who loves it and not just uh, anyone. Oh, actually in the priorities, I'm going to do Jerd. Uh, we're going to do increased pri priority for art. And Del... You will do increased priority care. I think that looks good. Actually, we don't want anyone doing art except Jerd. Whoa, it cycles all the way through. Okay. Let's we'll do high priority, not super high. And eventually we'll want someone to cook. I guess we don't have a cook yet either. No. So we need a cooker, we need a researcher. We have idle dupes. That's never good. Let's shave this off. So they can build the ceiling. Oxygen looks good. Any germs in here? Not yet. Except for this poopy area. I should probably sweep up the this area. So now we got a mess hall, so we're getting a little bit more for the, for that. But we want to turn it into a great hall to get the uh, more morale bonus. It's plus six instead of plus three, and all we need in there is a piece of art and a water cooler. I think. Stick a water cooler in there.
Now the starting algae and the starting water can last quite a while. I didn't, I was, I actually didn't get a whole lot of starting water here compared to some other maps I've seen. So we're going to have to be pretty careful with it. I'm going to disable the cooler. I think it'll still work. Food is decent. I'm going to build another floor for plants, I think. I should be using the the farm tile because it's got no decor issues. But uh, I think I'll just use a regular tile. Uh, maybe I'll just jam some mealwood in here. What do we got here? Anyone who likes research? Plus three learning. Interests. No no one interested in research. Biohazardous. That's probably not good in this new brave new world. But I'm gonna try it anyway. Let's see how sick they get. Now I won't stick with mealwood forever. I usually switch to mushrooms at one point, but mushrooms are gonna be harder to deal with because they're we need slime, and slime is full of slime lung. Eh, maybe they'll just get sick. It's not the end of the world. It used to, the dupes used to be able to die from slime lung, but no longer, it's no longer the case. As far as I know, they just get slowed down and they sneeze. And when they sneeze, the germs come out and make slime lung in the air. So it's like this, train wreck, this cascading effect. Okay, that new dupe, we can't, we can't do anything yet. Jobs board priority nine, uh, maybe eight. Go a bit faster here. Okay, research. What should we do next? I want to get into coal power pretty early, but I also want art, and I also want pressure management. Oh, so many things to do here. Let's do decontamination so I can start cleaning the dirty air. I can open the doors. That'll speed them up a bit. We can dig out the next room here. I thought about doing special shapes. Last time I did a circle. I've done a pyramid, a circle. I got a suggestion to do a honeycomb, but I think it would be problematic. <laughs> here we got our compost now. Now, do I actually want to compost? Hmm. You know what? I think I'll not compost for a while. This gives off polluted dirt, which we'll filter at some point. How's our food? 23,000. Let's go a bit faster here. Some low priority sweeps. Oh, not in there though. Okay. Oh, that was a. Uh, what was that? Research done? Yeah. We're making our way to decontamination. Look at them clean. <laughs> Speed demons. Impossibly fast. So, oh, lots of shine bugs. Maybe do a little bit of exploring this way, not too far though. Let's 
Same here. How hot is it over here? Pretty hot, 40 degrees. We'll want to insulate the base at some point, but no rush. Okay, was that decontamination? No, not quite. What did we get here? We got some plumbing, sinks, showers, mesh tile. I could use mesh tile. Between. We got food is decayed. That's okay. We'll just let them clean up for a while here. Put in a floor. Oxygen's good. CO2 is starting to build up a little bit. I'm going to start to do a mass dig down here. Just shave all this down. Leave a big giant hole for the CO2 to go into. Maybe find some food in the process. Bristle blossoms, these are never going to grow, so we're going to dig those up. We might get a morb here. Okay. What do we got here? Food. Uh, suit wearing. This duplicate enjoys wearing suit wearing errands. Interesting. Never seen that before. Good at fair at farming. Lab sleeper. I'm gonna go for Makru. <laughs> Caregiver. Yeah. I'm not sure I like this odd, like this floor is four high, this one's too high, but whatever. Living on the edge. Get this out. Doing research. I probably set these too high priority. Nope. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. <laughs> you, get out of there. Both of you. Dupes have a death wish. Oh, it's gonna happen again. <laughs> okay, that's probably a good amount of room for them to. Are they going to get stuck here? Let's build them a little ladder in case they do something moronic here. How's that research coming? Oh, I'm done. Why does it say I'm... Oh, I need advanced research. Okay, that's what I need. Let's do... A supercomputer. Oops. Hook that up. Okay. Then they can actually finish the research I told them to do. Colony lacks advanced research skill. Okay. Let's just assign someone. No, we, have, we can't assign anyone yet. Okay, we'll have to wait until they level up. I'm gonna put a floor in here while we wait. That should be priority eight. Uh, whatever. They're done it already. <laughs> so, oh, someone just leveled up. I think. Nope. Who's close to leveling here? Anyone? Yeah. Gossman, you're about to level. Then we can start cleaning the air. 
There we go. There we go. Okay, skills. Gossman, you're not great at research, but... Oh, cannot master. Oh yeah, they don't even have points. Okay, Adele, I guess you're going to be our researcher, even though you're not very good at it. Maybe. Yeah, sure. No one needs a medic yet, so... Someone else leveled up? Gosman. Oh, maybe you can do her. We'll have two people on research. Why not? Actually, they're good at cooking. We don't have a cook yet. Uh, you can be a cook. Let's get that. Can we select your hat? Not yet. Now can we? Yeah, grilling. Perfect. How's the oxygen in here? Not bad, not bad. How's our algae? Eight tons. We will run out. There's only so much of it here. And then we'll have to dive into the slime. Which is okay. We'll get slime lung. We'll survive. Let's, let's trim this off. Who's ready to level up? Peaches! Crop tending. And let's set peaches to do farming more than anything else. You can do more art. Once we get a Masterworks art artist, then we can start doing some fancy art. Actually, I think I can put a planter in here. Maybe. Oh, I don't have them yet. How's our water supply? Water supply is good. Oxygen's good. Things are good. Let's build a floor here. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Just carve this out. Okay, who do we got? Diver's lungs. Can't cook. That's fine. Coal, we don't really need it that badly. We love diver's lungs. Okay, Joshua, you are in. And I think I'll stick with six dupes for now. Okay, we're almost done that research. Let's check our gas overlay here. Ventilation. Oh, materials overlay, that's what I want, but just gas. So we got carbon dioxide. There's the polluted oxygen in there. Okay. I'm going to put some deodorizers around. Priority eight, sure. One there. Maybe one here. One here. One there. Seems good. And now we want airflow next, I think. That's under pressure management. We'll do that. And I set the I usually set the deodorizers to priority six. Let's dig this out a little bit. Hopefully this doesn't flood. If this floods, I'm in big trouble. It could break. It's not that much water though. It should be fine. Famous last words. What we could do is put some airflow in there. So, deodorizer is priority six. You and you. Let's dig this out a bit. What have I done here? This is kind of ugly.
No train wrecks yet. Can catch up. Food is very good. I should be turning this into meal. Meal wood. I mean, meal lice. Lice loaf. But I don't think I will. We'll just let them eat it as is. Got some. Lots of food poisoning in the air here. These two are sleeping in. Fine, fine, fine. Uh. They're so happy. Jeez. Who's ready to level up? Devin. Uh, you can be the super hard digger. And do you have a hat? Devin, you don't have a hat. Let's get your hat on. Well, let's do super hard digging hat. Devin. Joshua, what, what's your deal? Oh, you're, you're not doing anything. You're waiting to level. Fine, okay. Gotta get ranching pretty soon so we can put all these hatches away in a little pen. I'll put, uh, can I do potted plants yet? No, I haven't done art yet. We're doing airflow, then art. Then coal power. Do some more cleaning. Okay, we have pressure management, we got that. Let's do art next. So we can get uh, some planters in the in here so they can get more morale. And I'm gonna explore this way, see what we have over there. Always good to be exploring. And I think we can go up here safely without hitting any slime lung. Maybe a bit higher. Fast speed feels really slow now. <laughs> We're getting 60 FPS though, that's good. That's a first. Well, it's early, it's early days. We got good enough airflow here. We're almost done. Oh, I have airflow tiles now. Let's do those. Airflow. Okay, I want these to be somewhat. some semblance of. Okay, we're gonna do. like that, and then maybe every five. I, I always overdo these. One, two, three, four, five space, and then do it like that. One, two, three, four, five. Sure. That way all the CO2 can go to the bottom. One, two, three, four, five. Is that right? One, two, three, four, five, and then space. Actually, I already got them by the corner there. I'll just do them like that. Okay. I guess I should do some composting, but I'm kind of out of room here. I guess I could take up this deodorizer. I'm a little bit worried about this water though. I'm gonna go in here, even though there's slime lung in here. 
I'll do an airlock. Take this out. Something like that. We'll go in here. We'll start cleaning the air out. Because it's all polluted and yuckiness in here. So we'll probably do something like this. Just a ladder down here. Take that out. Take that out. Depending on the germs. Seems somewhat safe. And then we'll do a deodorizer on either side of the airlock here. Maybe one there too. There's tons of sand, so just use them. Lots of them. Okay, even with three toilets, we're about to have a toilet emergency here. What priority did I do? do all this stuff? Eight. Let's do this. It's all six. Uh, someone. Come clean this. Yellow alert. Not to be confused with the red alert. I guess I'll set that back down to an eight. Because of all the toilets here being cleaned and someone has to go to the bathroom. I'll probably pee right here. And it, it wouldn't, it might, no, it wouldn't leak in our water supply. It could here though. Okay, these will be party six. So I'm kind of containing it with the airlock a little bit. Lots of slime lung in there. Now they're probably going to get sick. But that's okay. It doesn't Like I said, it doesn't kill them. We'll start cleaning this air out. Maybe put a airflow tile here. Deodorizer riser here. And then we'll, then we'll only go in there to change these filters, which will not be that often. Okay, next research. Uh, probably... I want to do coal power. But for coal power, I need smart batteries. And for smart batteries, I need brute force refinement. So we'll do brute force refinement first. And now we can do a planter. Flower pot. Let's stick one of those granite in here. Maybe take this out a little bit more. I could be sacrificing water in order to get more calories, but I think I'll just get them to eat the lice, the mealwood directly. Okay, we're gonna put a briar. Oh, what is this? Spore? Sporched seed. Ooh. New plant. Okay, let's do briar. And I think that'll turn this into a great hall once they get that planted. Planted it. Now what do we got? Great hall. Good. Let's check morale. Six around. Uh, that'll go up to nine once they start using the great hall. And their expectations are really, really low. No one is ready to skill up. Algae is okay. CO2 levels down here. We could put a terrarium at the bottom here. Do a low priority dig here so we can see what's over this way. Okay, we got a little bit more water. We can't breathe down here. That's no good. I'm going to put a terrarium down here, I think. 
Yeah, let's do a terrarium at the very bottom so they can breathe. And I'm going to make this a little bit of a CO2 pit that we can put mushrooms in later. So I need a ladder. I'll put a wall. Put a wall here. And then a ladder so they can get out. This will be a big giant CO2 pit, which we can extend later. It'll get trapped in there. Something like that. The pit of death. <laughs> At least they can breathe here now. It's a little bit of oxygen coming off this. Make that priority six. And I'm going to put a deodorizer beside it because polluted water is going to come out of it. And we want that to get cleaned. 45 degrees. I'm kind of searching for ice biome. It's probably far away, but... Okay, next research. Uh, we got brute force refinement. Uh, so I'm going to do smart batteries next. And then coal power. And let's get that rock granulator going. I'll just put it in the miscellaneous room here. <laughs> Speed through the night. Okay, one person's sick with slime lung. Joshua got slime lung. Let's go take a look at him. Wait a minute. Yeah, Joshua. Okay, it doesn't go directly to them. Fine. Joshua. What does it say? 2.6 cycles left. And what does slime lung do now? It reduces breathing, reduces athletics, and they cough. And when they cough, they cough out slime lung, so that slime lung will start to accumulate in the base now. Whenever they cough, but it will die off in clean oxygen, so things might be okay. I was reading the forums and people were complaining about how slime lung works now when they cough. There's no easy way to quarantine them. But I figured it's pretty easy. We can just make a little room for them. That we lock them in. Oh, here he is. Look at him. Oh, jeez. Oh. Joshua, where'd you go? Oh, look at you. You're not a happy camper. Wonder if we can catch him in mid sneeze. <laughs> Poor guy. Oh, he just sneezed. Okay, perfect. But, uh. Slime lung come out? I think because there's food poisoning in the air, it didn't actually do anything. Pretty sure you just sneezed. But like I said, they don't die anymore, so it just slows them down a bit. Who's ready to Joshua, you're ready to level up. Uh, what should you do? You're good at you're good at carrying, so you can do that first. And that seems like a good place to leave things here. I think. Oh, he just sneezed again. Let's just see if there's any in the air. Oh. I don't see any. Ah, <laughs> nice little clap. Uh, but next time we'll get into smart batteries, coal power, more exploring, more research. So I hope you enjoyed this episode, uh, as always. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.